I'm standing here with the uncrowned 212 Men's Mr. Olympia, Eduardo Correa. You have to be ecstatic after a terrific showing yesterday up on that Olympia stage. A lot of people thought you should have gone home with the trophy. This was the best you ever looked. You came back from a, a terrible tricep tear last year. Give me, a, give me an idea of what you're feeling right now. Oh, man. When I got here uh, last Sunday, I was very happy just to be here, no? Because I can't imagine to compete this year. So when I, when the guys call me in the first call out, they say, oh, I'm, I'm very happy. So top three, I'm so excited. And then to battle for the title with Flex Lewis was amazing. And the people was amazing at the audience. When you, got off, when you got off stage after prejudging, and a lot of people I'm sure were telling you, this could be your show. Um, what was going through your mind at that point? And I even understand Flex Lewis even said something to you that he thought you looked amazing. Oh yeah, but honestly, uh, the way in, I was not confident. But I, when I go back to hotel, I saw the pictures, I said, oh, I can. <laughs> <laughs> you look I, pretty good, huh? Yeah, I believe it, I can. So, I, yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm very happy because I, I did my best. I, I, I did a great show, so. Was it hard coming back from the tricep tear once you had it, you know, fixed? Yeah, it's getting better. It's not 100%. So, because I pushed so hard my my body to stay here to compete this year, so now I have to be smart and I have to take a, bre a break. And maybe I do. I'm doing the Arnold Classic 212. Are you gonna year. do the one in uh, in the United States here? Yeah, probably. Yeah. So you won't do any of the European tour shows? No, no, I have to go back to Brazil to work with my sponsors, do workshops and travel there. So. Yeah, well, m money comes to calls. Now let me ask you this question. After the pre-judging, uh, Chris Cicito told me that, that Flex Lewis came up to you and said something to you. What did he say to you? Yeah, I said, I said to him, uh, man, you inspired me to give my best, so this cause I'm here. So uh, he recognized my, my great work and he said congratulations you are a great champion is a real champion so I've did that mean a lot to you yeah yeah, yeah. It's, it's, it was very nice of his part well this was this puts you in the number two spot right now going into next year you're the going to be the man to beat you know flex lewis has got to watch out for you you could be the next mr olympia 212 champ how does that feel just hearing that title yeah, now I believe that I can. So I think it's crazy, man. Uh, I, 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 it's a, like a dream, no? So, what, what weight did you weigh before you had to come down? Before Chris had to bring you down? Were you up as high as 225? No, yeah, I got here six days before the show with 218. Wow. 212. So. I have to go down for 212 is so hard. Six pounds you had to lose, and you really were pretty pretty lean. Oh yeah, but I look I look good with 212. So I the good thing was the way in was Wednesday, so I have time to recover and get full in the chest, shoulders. Congratulations on a great job done. Thanks so much. Thanks so much. I want to say thanks to my fans and mostly the Brazilians that come to see the show. So thanks so much.